Now, in this patient, we make a control one month after the varicocele operation. The first thing we want to see is the blood supply of the testes is very nice. Blood is coming to testes nicely. In these patients, there, are, there were big varicose veins, and uh, with our technique, Istanbul varicocelectomy technique, we take out all the vessels. So, when we look with Doppler ultrasonography, there are only arteries and little, very small, tiny veins. Here we see vas deferens, this is sperm channel, and other than this, uh, there is no residual veins. In normal, standard, uh, conventional varicocele operations, we ligate the veins here in uh, inguinal channel, and the residual veins in the testicular side, they swell with blood, and they disappear in three months. But in this technique, we take out these vessels completely. So soon after the operation, immediately after the operation, all the veins have gone. And we can see everything is normal just one month after the surgery. This is very nice for left side. And now we will look to right side. This is right testis. And the blood supply of the testis is very nice again. The most important part of varicocele operation is to keep the arterial blood supply. I look to arteries in the sperm channel, spermatic cord. This is spermatic cord. We can see the arteries nicely and there is no residual veins. All the vascular structures are disappeared. It's very successful operation. The patient has pain before the operation in both sides and now they all disappeared. He's very happy with the operation.